Hey guys, what's up? This is Karan here back with a new video and you're welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. I have installed Evolution X custom room which is based on Android 10 on my Redmi Note 8 as you can see it is based on Android 10 and this is Evolution X version 4.20.2 Homecoming unofficial with April security patch This is the latest build of Inception custom room This is the latest build of Evolution custom room What are the things you get in this custom room and how are the things working Is it the best custom room ever to use everything in this video so make sure you watch this video till the end let's get started now okay so as always i will start with the home screen so by default the launcher which you get is the google pixel launcher as you can expect it from here but the main thing is about this room is the smoothness this is pretty much smooth custom room no lags whatsoever i didn't got any single lag and working without any issues at all you can see google feed here which is also working and by scrolling or swiping or anything you didn't feel any lag you will not feel any single lag here if we talk about quick settings you can see you have the option of enabling the header image from settings which looks like this you have a lot of options to change these header image from here and also have the option to choose the footer text as i already written here subscribe to tech current so i already request you to subscribe to my channel to get notified and get all the new videos new rooms related videos on my channel regarding redmi note 8 and other devices too in the form of gsi or any other things we have a lot of options to add quick setting tiles here like ambient display screencast invert color status ever a lots and a lots of tiles are here if you click here you don't get any option to customize the tiles from here and okay so let's move forward let's check out some things first of all we will take a look at the default camera app the default camera app which you get here is the anx camera which is working as you can see and if we talk about portrait mode that is also working too one thing is you will not get 48 megapixel camera here you have to sacrifice your 48 megapixel camera as you can see there is no option of enabling the 48 megapixel camera here and if we talk about gcam i have installed two gcams first one is gcam 7.2 and another one is gcam 7.3 and uh, whenever we open this camera app when we click photos photos are clicking but you can see here this looks like in pink color i don't know what's going on but it is not working at all whenever you click photos these are not clicking perfectly as you can see it is showing as a pink in portrait mode camera mode everywhere it is not working at all as you can see so gcam is working but not working like this and i have tried another gcam this one is gcam 7.3 i think this one is gcam 7.2 and this where also too you can see this look like this i don't know how it's going on what's happening but gcam is not working you have to sacrifice your cameras here you can try out tr cam hyper cam there are a lot of gcam alternatives available so if you want to try out those gcams you can try out if you want to if we talk about geekbench score the geekbench score is awesome mind blowing as you can see i have already posted a status on my youtube community tab if you have seen that 312 is a single core and 140, 1400 plus is the multi core score, which is unbelievable on Redmi Note 8. In single core, you can see we average got 308, but in this room, we get 312 with a single core. And if we talk about multi core, this is unbelievable. 1311 is the average score, and in this room, we get 1401 which is just awesome so in the terms of performance in the terms of battery life this room is one of the best custom room if you want to try out you will not feel any single lag here you will not feel anything here gaming is awesome performance is awesome battery is awesome overall one of the best custom room if you want to try out you also get the wallpaper app here it has a lot of evolution x wallpapers so you don't have to search for the wallpapers on internet or anywhere else it has a lot of wallpapers wallpapers from evolution x team another positive thing another good thing so that's good one again 
so let's take a look at in the settings settings here network and internet connected devices apps and notifications everything is same like the other rooms in battery section as i already shown you the battery backup is perfect i cannot show you the graph exactly but the battery backup is super because i'm using from some time and it is working perfectly and looking very good in display section you have the option of dark theme adaptive brightness all other things like the same other custom rooms too so i will not show you all those features we will get back to the main part here the evolver which is the main theming section of evolution x room it has a lot of features which you get in evolution x custom room so we will take a look at those features one by one first section we have the theme section where you can choose the body font headline or body font there are a lot of options to choose the fonts here you can choose the status bar icon style to rounded filled or circular okay you can choose the header image as i already shown you this one is the header image you can choose from here in image collection there are a lot of options to customize your header image too and also you can choose the static or automatic whichever you like you can choose that one also you can choose the opacity here quick settings header color new tint style and you can also have extra options to customize your quick settings here if we talk about status bar obviously you got the clock options carry level network and routing corners and also status bar items here and you can also choose the battery and at last you have the status bar network icons where you can choose the volty icon the volty icon is not showing because my carrier does not support volty that's why it is not showing here but it is working perfectly it is tested if we talk about notifications you have the option of heads up also have the option of edge lighting which looks perfect and also you can choose the auto color option which is mind blowing it will adapt your notification light with the edge lighting and your apps notification light with the edge lighting which looks perfect also have the option of force low notifications force expanded notifications and also dose brightness config and at last blink for call waiting in quick settings you have the option of quick pull down hide battery icon battery percentage and a lot more simple things where you can choose the layout of your quick settings you can choose the columns rows rows in landscape and columns in landscape or portrait etc you have the option of quick setting footer text as i already shown you like this subscribe to tech current whichever you want to like whichever you want to write here you can write here easily running services icon user switcher icon and edit icon a lot of things are available here okay so if we talk about some other things like power menu you have extra options of advanced restart flashlight and airplane settings a lot of things are here you can add from here gestures as you can see i am using full screen gestures that means these are working perfectly you also get some extra gesture options like jump to camera in system navigation i am using gesture navigation and you also have the option to customize your gesture navigation too like low full and block height of virtual keyboard as touchable region for back gesture and hide the navigation bar pill as i already chosen this option and it looks perfect very very good looking and lift to check phone adaptive playback and touch screen gestures etc so all other things are almost same like the other things lock screen navigation animation and miscellaneous everything is same like the other things so this was all from the short and simple review of evolution x custom room which is available for redmi note 8 if you want to try out the link is in description just download from there and install it as a normal custom room so this was all from today's video i hope you like this video thanks for watching have a nice day